All right, in this video, I'll discuss about top gainer. And first here, you can see this is Nifty and daily chart. As I said earlier that uh, Nifty, I'm looking for short after breaking this supporting line. Uh, one, four, uh, two, three, zero. I think you remember somewhere here, this level. And why I was looking for short, because they are forming a double top. Somewhere here, first top, second top. And this is the neckline at the level of 14,230. Uh, and when price broke, I'm looking for short. And next uh, support was 13730. That is my support. So exactly yesterday, you can see price hit uh, that level. And uh, uh, according to previous market behavior, price was bouncing off moving average 50. So this one 50 moving average and this one 20 and this one 100. So we have seen a uh, price pull back to the level of uh, 13,730 uh, 50 moving average act as a support somewhere. Have, have you seen? And this 50 moving average act as a support if you want to see the previous market behavior. Have you seen price hit and bounce? So exactly here you can see uh, when price appear, uh, sorry, uh, when price hit uh, 50 moving average after that they are forming a pin bar. All right. And uh, similarly right now here you can see they form a pin bar. So when they are appearing this type of candlestick pattern so it is a probability uh, to bounce again from uh, that level all right now let's see in a small time frame uh, like h4 now here you can see h4 chart uh, they form a inside bar have you seen they form a inside bar so it is a probability to bounce again from this level all right, so similarly here you can see they form an inside bar, this one, have you seen, inside bar, and they're bouncing off uh, 20, now they are forming an uh, inside bar. All right, now where is my entry point? Uh, to enter in this market, we must uh, see the small time frame, like 15 minute or H1, let's see H1 first, uh, here you can see H1 some uh, bullish pressure we have seen have we seen all right right now we have seen some bullish candlestick pattern and uh, let's see in a small time frame like 15 minutes let's just jump to 15 minutes let's zoom a little more and now again see how uh, price are uh, diverging have you seen and the price are forming lower low and the lower high uh, somewhere here lower low lower high uh, but uh, rsi are diverging all right they are creating higher high and higher low so this is called divergence have you seen they are creating higher high and higher low and but price are creating lower low so when appear this type of pattern it is a probability to change the trend so where is my anti point now I'm going to draw a trend line. So this is called trend line. I just connected this swing point, this swing point, and this swing point, swing point, and uh, this swing point finally broke. So I'm expecting that price will continue toward upside. All right. But remember, nobody never knows. If price break this supporting line, definitely I'll go for short because uh, uh, in a small time frame price are running in a down time. So that is uh, nifty. And then let's see uh, yesterday most gainer stocks. Uh, so here you can see first is uh, Axis Bank. Now let's just jump to Axis Bank and here. All right. Okay. Okay. All right, this one axis bank. 
Ah, okay. First daily chart. Yeah, now I can see Axis Bank. We have seen price are running in an uptrend. Have you seen? Creating higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low. And right now here I can see all mobbing average are arranging sequently, creating higher high, higher low. And if you want to see previous market behavior, price are bouncing of 50 moving average. Have you seen this one? Okay, let me remove this one. Price are bouncing of 50 moving average. And exactly price hit the 50 moving average. And now I can see here. When price appear uh, 50 moving average, uh, sorry, when price hit the 50 moving average, we have seen bullish pin bear. Why you can say hammer pattern? Now, when price uh, hit the 50 moving average, what we have seen? This is called bullish engulfing pattern in a daily time map. So, means uh, it is continued that toward upside. All right. So, down uh, you can say the correction or uh, this correction has completed. All right. So, now uh, it is a probability to continue to add the upside. Right. So, where is my uh, uh, anti point? So, in that case, so I'll I'll connect this higher point and let's just jump to 15 minute. Now I can see I need a breakout somewhere here. All right. Now they are creating a higher high, a higher low, and my entry point would be six, uh, seven, uh, three. All right. That that is my entry point. So this is Axis Bank. So I'm looking for buy today. And next. Mm, SBI. So all banks are running toward upside. SBI M. All right. Superb. Uh, first the daily time frame. Okay. Uh, here also you can see running in uptrend, bouncing of uh, twenty moving average. Now they are uh, fifty moving average act as a support. So we have seen yesterday bullish candle. So Okay, in that case, uh, still price are running below 20 moving average. Uh, all right, so what I'll do here. Okay, just a minute. All right, so I'm looking for buy when price will break the level of 286 because there are 20 moving average somewhere here. Have you seen? I'm looking for buy after breaking 28, uh, let's say 7. 287. Alright, I can see price are running in uptrend in a small time frame, like 5 minutes or whatever, according to the price action model. Alright, but I'm looking for buy after breaking this level of 287. Alright, so there are 200 exponential moving average in a 15 minute chart and the daily chart, there are 20 moving average. So I need a breakout. IOC next, IOC. Okay, then oil corporation IOC. Okay, this one for intraday. Now I can see uh, here this is the IOC getting higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low. Now 200 moving average act as a support, and I'm looking for buy. Uh, somewhere here after breaking the level of here somewhere here 93 above 93 I'm looking for buy above 93 all right and let's see in a small time frame like here okay um, somewhere here you can see 93 if price break the level 93 i'll close my position around 94 for one rupees i can go for buy so once they break this level sorry once they break this level uh, uh 94 so again i'll go for buy all right okay now another stock uh, Three cement, so I'm not interested. <coughs> Sorry, uh, Hero Motor 3000. Okay, 
hero motor here I can see they're running an up trend all right all right okay 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 hero motor but uh, uh, price exactly near supporting line here you can see this is the support and uh, price again pull back and if you now see h4 chart and price drop again pull back oh, h1 so still they are running in a sideway market h4 and i can see h4 they are running in a sideway and uh, somewhere here i'm not looking for buy in this area but uh, i'm expecting price will give a pull back to the level of so somewhere here around um, 3 3 uh, 2 0 because it's a support oh sorry resistance raise then now it's a forming a support so i need a uh, bullish confirmation somewhere here but strictly i will follow a cell because uh, this uh, uh, hero motor uh, they are trying to run here in a sideway market all right and i'll close my position somewhere around three four seven zero that 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 is my target and the next the last one let me show you last icici bank okay not that much okay icici bank icici bank okay bank h1 daily time frame uh, price pullback act as a support somewhere here 50 moving average act as a support and the h4 support forming by 100 exponential moving average and there's somewhere here still running a downtrend h1 so i need the breakout somewhere here it's a strong support uh, sorry strong resistance right now and that case 15 minute chart i'm looking for by after breaking the level of uh, of 540 540 all right after breaking this level now price are running around 528 but i'm not interested to take any buy position somewhere here because still running in a downtrend in a 15 minute time frame all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching